My name is Sanjay Gupta. I'm a cardiologist in York. Today's video is entitled Taurine and the Heart. Right, so could a simple overlooked amino acid help lower your blood pressure, support your heart muscle and even improve your lifespan? So today I want to talk to you about taurine, which is often associated with energy drinks, but now is getting serious attention in cardiology research. What is taurine? So taurine is a uh, naturally occurring amino acid, which is found in high concentrations in the brain, the eyes, and more importantly, the heart. It plays a role in calcium signaling, cell membrane stability, and even bile salt formation. It is found in meat and seafood, but people on plant-based diets typically get less of it. How does taurine affect the heart? In the heart, taurine helps regulate calcium within cells, and this is crucial for strong rhythmic contractions. It also has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties, helping to protect the heart from oxidative stress. What does the evidence say? There was a 2018 review which showed that taurine supplementation may modestly reduce blood pressure. In small trials and heart failure patients, taurine seemed to improve left ventricular function. And in a major 2023 NIH-funded study in science, taurine deficiency was shown to contribute to aging. And if you supplemented taurine, then there was a reversal in multiple aging markers in mice and monkey models. With regards to safety and dosing, a typical dose is 500 to 2,000 milligrams per day, but taurine is well tolerated and doses of up to 3 grams per day have been studied without major side effects. It is not a stimulant and therefore should not cause palpitations. However, if you have kidney disease or are on multiple medications, it is best to consult your doctor first. Should you supplement? Well, I don't think it's a magic pill. But for people with early heart failure, mild hypertension, or those on vegan diets, taurine could be a valuable addition to your regimen. I often say if it's safe, affordable, and has plausible benefits, then it is worth considering. Nevertheless, I would always recommend that you check with your usual care practitioner first. Have you ever taken taurine? And if you have, I would love to hear what your experience has been. Thank you so much.